Hey guys, welcome back to Jenna's Reading Corner. Today we'll be reading Chapter 3 of Poppy the Pirate Dog and the Missing Treasure by Liz Kessler, illustrated by Mike Phillips. Chapter 3 Poppy sulked all the way home from the vets. She wasn't the best treasure keeper, and she wasn't wearing an eye patch. What do you think she's wearing, guys? She was wearing an enormous plastic collar around her neck to keep her from rubbing her eye. Poppy thought it looked like the lampshade in the living room. She had never felt less like a pirate. Poppy went straight to her bed. She didn't want even get up when the doorbell rang. She just lay there feeling miserable. Tim and Susie opened the door. It was the next door neighbors, Mr. and Mrs. Roy, with their son, Kyran. Sorry to bother you, Mrs. Roy said. We wondered if you'd seen our tortoise, Missy. She was sunning herself outside this morning, but now we can't find her. Tim and Susie shook their heads. Sorry, Susie said, but we'll keep a lookout, Tim added. Thank you, Mr. Roy said. Before they left, Kyron saw Poppy and burst out laughing. What are you laughing at? at Poppy thought grumly, grumpily. I thought you said she was a pirate dog, Kyron said. I didn't know pirates wore giant ice cream cones on their heads. It's a lampshade, actually, thought Poppy as she marched into the, into the yard. End of chapter one, or chapter three. I hope you guys enjoyed the Poppy the Pirate Dog, and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye!